Hey folks, Simon here. Welcome back to Final Fantasy VII. Today I want to show you a couple of things. The first uh, thing I want to show you is how you can get M Tentacles. I believe that stands for Mulba Tentacles or something along those lines. Uh, and that comes courtesy of Red Mario 13 Nanaki 36 over at Stream. And the other thing I want to show you is the Death Sentence Enemy Skill. So both of these things are available when you have access to the G Cave, which is in Cosmo Canyon. It's part of the story. Um, you guys know it, I'm sure. Well, during this section is when you can go ahead and get both of these things. Now, the death sentence enemy skill isn't all that useful, to tell you the truth, but it is still good to get for reasons of just being able to complete the enemy skill materials. We can also get it again later on. Um, but for now, we're going to get it on two characters. And M Tentacles, I believe that stands for Mulberry Tentacles, based on the fact that the effect of that item is to cast the very powerful Bio 3 on all enemies, or all targets rather, which is obviously very nice. Now, what you're going to want to do is make your way into the next area once you head into the dungeon here. So that means uh, just breaking open the... Uh, whatever it is in that cave that opens this entrance here and then the next area is going to be our friend You can actually encounter the sneaky step I believe they're called in this area um, But as per Red Mario's tip they're a lot more common here the area with the slippery oil on the floor And they can spawn in groups of three which is helpful because what that means is that we have a good chance of getting the actual M tentacles uh, And that's because you can't steal them. They're only a drop Right, so what have we got here? There we go. Uh, three sneaky steps. Yep. So what we're going to do first of all uh, is actually just wait for death sentence. You can also manipulate them if you want to get death sentence forcibly for whatever reason without having to wait for it. Which kind of, make, kind of makes sense because otherwise uh, you could end up getting killed if it's on the wrong character. Uh, so there we go. We're just going to cast death sentence on Barrett. And then we can finish them off very quickly with beta, which is helpful. And yeah, they just have a chance, I think it's a 12.5% chance per each one that you kill of actually dropping the M tentacles, relinquishing it for us. Um, but if not, at least you get the death sentence. Now, I do strongly recommend making sure you get at least one M tentacles. Uh, and that's simply because of the fact that even if you don't want to farm too many, you're probably going to want to be able to max them out at some point later on. And by having one, you can use the W item glitch when that becomes available. But to be honest with you, it shouldn't take too long to get just one or two at this stage. Because as you can see, they do spawn in these groups of three fairly regularly. And there we have it. We've got our first. Uh, a little tip for you as well. Red Mario suggested that they won't. St uh, you won't be able to get the drop if you attempt to steal from them. Now, I don't know why you would do that. Because there's actually nothing on their uh, steal table anyway. So you couldn't get anything. But apparently even trying to steal from them is enough to prevent them from relinquishing their drop. So just bear that in mind as well. But there we go. We've got through like three battles in about one and a half minutes if that. And we've already got, well, we've got one M tentacles. I don't suspect it would take much longer uh, to get another one if we wanted to. So, see what we get here. Okay. Well, you guys get the idea anyway. Um, but even if you don't care about the M tentacles, make sure you do get the death sentence because it's another enemy skill to tick off the list, isn't it? And at the end of the day, we want to go for everything that the game has to offer. Want to get our money's worth, so to speak. But alright then folks, I think we'll leave it there, even if we don't get another one, which we don't. Yeah, thanks for stopping by, hope you enjoyed the video, and let me know in the comment section if you get your hands on uh, more than one of these M tentacles. In fact, before we finish up, um, I'm just going to cast one, see what they're like in battle. Since this isn't a save file that I'm actually using right now anyway. Uh, I didn't sort it, so it's going to be right down the bottom, no doubt. Yeah, make sure, guys, if you know you're going to be using items in battle, a little bit of a bonus tip here for you, that you do actually sort them out before you actually come into battle. Um, otherwise, as you can see, it's a right nightmare trying to find them. Uh, let's see what we've got. Well, they do a lot of damage, actually. A lot of damage. As well as inflicting the poison status ailment as well, of course. So, yeah, I'd recommend you get a few if you can. And uh, look at that. We've got one to replace the one we just used. Nice. All right, then, folks. Well, there we have it then. M tentacles and death sentence. Hopefully, we'll be yours. See you next time.